Hi, welcome to a short description of the purge procedure. If you haven't yet uh, read the manual, uh, chapter 3.3 of the manual, then I suggest you do so before watching this video because there might be a few clicks uh, I'm going to do that need further explanation and that explanation is in the manual. Okay, as you can see, we've loaded a kit with uh, a lot of instruments and all of these instruments use uh, yeah, all the available articulations and you can see some of them have uh, alternating uh, samples so as you can see here 840 megabytes is the amount of ram that is currently being used and that's uh, quite a lot and um, yeah this is our arrangement uh, a short little snippet of course your song would be longer but uh, this is enough to get the picture it sounds like this So just like some kind of example song. Now, um, yeah, let's do it. We'll remove all the samples now. And this um, takes a while because there's an awful lot of samples that uh, must be removed from the memory right now. And if this is completed, then you will see that um, this display here, the RAM usage will uh, read zero, as well as these uh, individual uh, displays here. Um, the currently uh, lit uh, green light will change to the red light, uh, which means that um, no samples are loaded, like this. And um, yeah, then we'll go on. We'll first reset all the purge markers. We'll go to the engine tab, click restart engine. And then let's set this tempo very high. So, and back again. And now let's update the sample pool. Done. And as you can see, uh, 33 megabytes uh, is the amount of RAM that is now used. Um, quite a difference. And again, we restart the engine. And now let's hear how it sounds. <laughs> 